Uh, hi. Welcome to uh, Let's Play Bioshock. Fuck it, start the game. Uh, I guess Sam. Andy's really... Uh, I'm Justin. This is Aaron. That's Andy. So that's you asshole. Know. Yeah, you know, the, you know the drill by now, <laughs> if you've been watching us. So, um... Yeah, he's just really anxious to get this uh, level done because it is a fucking long one. So, yep, there's Gather here. I'm pretty sure this couch is trying to eat me. No, oh, that's just drop. She's just talking about her mommy. Yep. That's Willard. How many shotguns does it take? How many shotguns does it take? Kill the spider splicer. Too fucking many. How did you I, 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 with a fucking drill, I would be concerned. Come on, Daddy. He just said ta -da. Daddy, are you taking me home, too? Maybe later. <laughs> Where the hell did he... Willard, I love you, Willard. Where the hell did he come from? But yes, now every security thought we ever get will have a name. And Justin loves that. Makes it more personal when he masturbates about them. Wait, what? <laughs> and, uh, where the hell is the last gather? Oh, I know. But first... Fuel? Wow, I have full frag grenades. I know what I'm using. And now for the most difficult gather of all of them. Because they literally come at you from every conceivable the direction. They're coming out the walls. Actually, yeah, I'm pretty sure one or two of them does. <laughs> Game over, man. Game uh -huh. over. I just squeeze my stress ball and out comes a robot. You just self-destructed. I deactivated it. Abandoning your little girl. I'm not abandoning her. You're too far away. I'm on the other side of the merry-go-round. For a kid, that's like the other side of the fucking planet. Yeah, where's your sensitivity? I'm like, <laughs> support you to child services right now. Well, she's done anyways. Yeah, those um, two little um. Uh, we got. What? I think you just ninja ported through his ass. I got him while he was teleporting. I you guess. now have inherited his power. <laughs> I wish. <sighs> Repair. Get. Jump it. I also love the little magical uh, dealy thing that goes on. Okay, so uh, now that I have, here's Martin. So now that I have the uh, little girl, I need to find. I need to find out where the hell the uh, icy room place is. 
because that's where you want to fight big sister. Not this way. Is that a dead ammo bandito? Yes, it is a dead ammo bandito. <laughs> I think I can make a horrible offensive Mexican stereotype with that about being burned to death. But I'm too lazy. Is this the way? What is it? This place is too fucking huge. That's where he came from. This the way? Maybe? Okay, there's the theater. Don't even know anymore. You wait for real ah! <laughs> Scared me. Yeah. Or at least Indeed. Me. Go change your pants, please. <laughs> Call me sons of bitches. Shit. Everyone shits, not just Kami sons of bitches. Okay, at least that one was labeled as corpse. The f How the hell did I get back here? Sorcery. I don't even know where I am anymore. I, I really wish, at least for this one, that when you actually broke open to it, the name changed to unsafe. That would just make my day. Okay, this is where I got the rocket launcher. You're welcome. This is, this is the freaking train well, station. Well, you see, um, have you ever seen uh, Cube 2? What? Cube 2. It's, I don't know, Andy, is that a horror movie, technically? Uh, more of a psycho thriller. Yeah, anyway. Well, it's about a bunch of people trapped in a hypercube and, like, moves, like, recycle and move themselves around. I think that's similar to what's happening in here. Every time I go through a door, the door takes me somewhere new. <sighs> Although I think I'm getting close. Because I want to be in that cool frozen room. It's kinda like the hotel and that. You punched him so hard his face came off. Kinda like the hotel and that episode here we go. the last season. Doctor Who, the God Complex. Ah, yes. Or I still don't get the end of that episode. Something like the Minotaur feeding off of the beef or something. Actually, it wasn't necessarily fear it was feeding off of it. was hope and belief. Okay, Not fear. so... Here's a vent. Oh, the world's smallest violin. Please tell me you did not just reference what I think you referenced. With me, Sorry. father, Stanley just let mother's followers turn into animals. When word came that she was returning, he knew they would blame him. So he found a way to silence them all. And now he's trying to cover it up. Oh, boo-hoo, he flooded the place. And why the fuck would I That's care? That's it! Now all that old dirt stays underground, and Lamb will be none the wiser. Hey, come on back. I've unlocked the train for you. Uh, but remember, if Lamb catches you, <laughs> mum's the word. Bloop, bloop. Now we play the waiting game. Delta, our conflict of interest seems to be upsetting Eleanor. For her sake, Gosh. I have made it clear to these men that you are not to suffer. I accept full responsibility for any anger you may experience before you die. I don't know. Doc Lamb 
Bravo's turning Isn't up the heat. Shame. Head on back to the train station. Let's hit the trail. I would, but I have a giant monster woman. Well, whatever you, you want to call it. You see, I... pencil neck. Did you notice the screech demon? <laughs> Probably gonna come through that door somehow. <laughs> I would not be surprised. Almost here. Yep. <laughs> Get off! Surprise, I was hiding in the safe. <laughs> With the other guy. <laughs> I'm just picturing her hiding my face. And all that guard. Yay, increased. My ammo. Mm. Oh no. You ran out of <laughs> Yep. <laughs> and now she dead. I tell you she's dead. Yeah, cause what little or what big sisters can do, they can actually take bystanders suck the atom out of them using that giant syringe thingy and um, use it to give herself her health back. That's evil. I love it. Yep. And now that that's done... No bees! Oh, wow. Is that Lady Gaga? Shut <laughs> We are annoyed. Yes, we are. We are getting aggravated. Uh, oh, almost, almost done. Finally, we're almost done. Oh, sorry. Um, it turns out the train is missing a few critical components for its engine. So you're gonna have to go back and exit Dionysus Park and uh, go to the last area you are in in order to recover said components for the train. I would murder everyone within a five mile radius of me. <laughs> <laughs> and also, now you have to return to Dionysus Park and uh, perform some voodoo rituals from the south on some of them there slices in order to enchant the engine. Oddly enough, that sounds like something he'd make me do. Being a Cajun and all, I cannot properly instruct you on how to do the food magic. <laughs> Was he just playing dead? <laughs> Almost back. Subject almost. Zelda. Almost. I've known for years of Stanley's betrayal here and had forgiven him. But in compromising Eleanor now, he seals his fate. You see, it was Stanley who turned you into Ryan. He is responsible for what you have become. The security booth is open now. You may have your revenge. Kill him. So, yep, Stanley's the reason I'm a big daddy. Sweet Jesus. Lamb, no! And she just let me hang myself out the... Oh, God! No, no, no. Come on, pal. The, the, the train's ready. Just... Just let me live! 
Do we get the kill? Huh? We can if we you want. Can, but that ain't our choice. Why no. is a shit house? Fine. Oh, the next spider splice will take care of you. Yeah, because let's face it. If it weren't for the fact that that door has been locked the entire time, he would have been gutted like a fish. So, um, and this is the end of the level. Pull the level. Thank God. Four episodes. Four fucking episodes. Luckily, the next level is shorter. Fontaine Futuristics. Which is different than the Fontaine Futuristics from the last game. It's more futuristic, son. It actually is. And uh, a new enemy class gets introduced, which is... Um, Potato Man. The Boom Boom. You, you know, I completely forgot about Mr. Potato. But um, actually, um, it, you're, you're familiar with this enemy. I'm not going to give it away, but uh, it's a fun one. And uh, you get to meet the... You get to meet a worm person. So, uh, Technically, he's a slug. Yeah, worm, slug, whatever. But yeah, a lot of, lot of interesting stuff for the next level, so uh, you may want to stay tuned for that. But, yep, this is the end of the episode, so this has been Aaron... And Eddie. And Justin. And never trust a Cajun. See you next time.